During the last years, we've observed and discovered the fact that application of gaucho improves health and increases growth, even in situations without insect infestations, leading to a considerable increase in yield. In addition to the insecticidal efficacy, recent research results have proven an additional abiotic and biotic stress shield mode of action in gaucho. The optimal growth and development of plants is a long way from the actual results in the field. When record yields are compared with average yields, the impact of the environment on plant productivity becomes apparent. The losses caused by biotic stress, such as fungal diseases or insect pests, should not be ignored, but the abiotic losses are tremendous. If there is no stress caused by insufficient water, heat, soil salinity or any other abiotic stress factor in the plant, we have optimal conditions for energy production. Photosynthesis works effectively. With the help of sunlight, the chloroplasts produce glucose from carbon dioxide and water. In the mitochondria, the power generators of the cell, the end product of photosynthesis, glucose, is transformed into chemical energy, the ATPs. They are the universal fuel of all living cells. For this so-called respiration process in the mitochondria, the cell needs, in addition to glucose and oxygen, a further energy-rich molecule, NAD+. When a plant starts suffering from abiotic stress, photosynthesis is impaired. For example, stress caused by lack of water. Photosynthesis still works, but on a lower level. Not all of the sunlight and carbon dioxide is processed into energy. The excess sunlight causes damage in the plant cell, resulting in the formation of aggressive and damaging free radicals. These free radicals activate numerous repair mechanisms in the plant cell, consuming large amounts of energy-rich NAD plus molecules. So, no more NAD plus is available in the mitochondria for ATP energy production. No more ATP can be produced. No more fuel for plant growth. When the plant is treated with gaucho, the active ingredient not only protects against insect pests, but is also metabolized to 6-CNA, which prevents a rapid depletion of the energy pool in plants under stress. This process is unique to our active ingredient due to its specific structure and physical chemical properties enhanced by an optimal formulation. Under stress, the cell repair mechanisms quickly consume the available energy pool of energy NAD+, leaving nicotinamide as an energy-poor end product in the cell. The plant recycles nicotinamide in several steps back into NAD+. And now, 6-CNA shows its value. It improves the recycling of NAD+. So, in the case of stress, more NAD+, becomes available again. That means less energy is consumed in the plant to react to stress. More energy is available for growth. The impact of stress is measurably mitigated in gaucho-treated plants. Our trial on drought-stressed barley shows the effect. Treated plants show a delayed increase of drought stress marker genes and at the same time photosynthesis remains at a higher level. The consequence? Extended energy production.
In addition, Gaucho activates the plant's own defense mechanism against fungal, bacterial and viral diseases, as demonstrated in this barley experiment. In this case, the cause of this effect is again the metabolite 6-CNA, which the plant cleaves from the active ingredient. 6-CNA is a systemic signal transmitter, comparable to the plant's own signal transmitter, salicylic acid. The plant accepts both messengers, so triggered by 6-CNA, the cells start production of pathogen defense proteins, aiding plants in the protection against diseases. When you remember the yield potential of crops under stress-free conditions, it is obvious. Gaucho with its reliable efficacy against insect pests and its additional stress shield mode of action offers a unique tool to secure higher yields and better quality.